Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to install Android OS in a Windows 10 operating system by the simplest way. I am currently using Windows 11, but same process is work with the Windows 10. So don't worry. First of all, we need two things. First is the Android iOS image. If you have any Android ISO image, then very good. If you not any Android iOS image, then I give a Android iOS image. Just go to the YouTube dis description link or Facebook description link and there we find multiple links. Just go to the any link that you like. I just go with the first link and I just download it from here. Just click at here. Just open that link and just download this Android iOS image. Okay. If you have not a any Android iOS image, if you have any Android iOS image, then don't worry. Skip this step. Okay. And save it on the desktop. Okay and save it it takes few minutes depending on the speed of your internet if your internet speed is very high then it takes two or three minutes or if you internet speed is very low then it takes one or two hours my internet speed is very high so it takes one or two minutes so wait for a few minutes or few seconds now our android is downloaded android ios image is downloaded just click on the close here is the, our android ios image so now the second step is just download an Oracle VirtualBox. So just go to the Anyway browser and here just type Oracle VirtualBox. Hit enter key on your keyboard. First link is from Oracle VM VirtualBox, Virtual Machine VirtualBox. Okay, just go to the here. Here we find download VirtualBox. Version number is always changed. Just go to the download VirtualBox. Don't worry about the version number. Just click at here. Here we find Windows host. Here is the Windows host. Just go with the Windows host. We are using Windows, so just go to the Windows host and just download it on the desktop. Okay. Download it on the desktop and just click on the start download. Okay. Now close this. Now here is the our virtual box. I have already downloaded the virtual box and installed it on my machine. So I don't download it once again. Just double click on this and just go to the next, next, next and install virtual box. Just go to the double click on it, click on the yes. next 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 okay i have already downloaded it install it okay now start the oracle virtual box okay now here is the my virtual box i have already downloaded and installed some virtual machines so here is the my some virtual machine and I now i want to install android virtual machine or android os on my windows 11 okay that windows 10 sorry that is very simple first of all just go to the here new and just create a new operating system i give the android you can give any name that you like android okay and in type i just go to the linux in version i just go with the linux 64 bit linux 2 0.63x 4x 64 bit if you're using 32 bit ios image then just go to the 32 bit i am using 64 bit so i just go to the 64 bit okay now just go to the next here give any ram that you like 1 gb is sufficient but you like then give 5 gb or 10 gb ram okay i just give the 5 gb ram okay now here is the our hard disk 8 gb now just click on the create here is the our vdi hard disk file okay just click on the next dynamically look allocated we allocated our hard disk dynamically so just go to the next here is the our hard disk it is 8 gb 8 gb is sufficient for the our android operating system if you want to like more hard disk then just scroll down it at here okay but 8 gb is sufficient okay just click on the create now our os or the virtual machine is created now just select our android and just go to the settings okay now just go to the here storage in storage here we find empty this is empty we want to android ios image at here so select this empty disk and just go to the disk disk and just go to the choose a disk file now just go to the desktop select our android ios image okay and click on the okay now just go to the start we are going to booting our or installing our android ios image okay just click on the start now 
our android ios images now booting okay now we just go to the install by arrow key just go to the install your mouse is not working in this uh, installation process so use your arrow key bottom arrow key and just go to the install install android 86 to hard disk okay hit enter key and now here we find create modify partition by down arrow key by down down arrow key just go to the create modify partition and hit enter key on your keyboard click okay here we find two things do you want to use gpt okay i don't want don't use gpt just go to the no okay here we find our this kind of uh, interface we just go to the new first of all by arrow key just go to the new and hit enter key and just hit enter key on primary okay and inside just go with the 8 gb okay now here just hit enter key on bootable just hit enter key at one time at the bootable now here we find flag boot and primary type is the primary okay now just go to the by arrow key just go to the right just go to the right okay and hit enter key on the right here just type yes are you sure you want to write a partition table to this okay we want it so i just type yes and hit enter key on our keyboard it's take one less than one minute okay be a patient and wait for a one minute okay now our partition is great by arrow key just go to the quiet okay and hit enter key now here we find one new hard disk 8 gb okay now just hit enter key on your keyboard okay okay the most imp part is here okay just go to the ext4 we format our hard disk virtual hard disk with the ext4 okay so 8gb hard disk is formatted with the ext4 click on the okay do you choose the format sta1 to ext4 okay i want this so click on the yes now our formatting is completed in a few seconds so be a patient and wait for a few seconds okay now our formatting formation is completed now it's asked to install grab boot loader okay install loader grab grab okay yes i want this now it's want the read write read and write permission okay i give the permission read and write yes i just go to the arrow key and just go to the yes and hit enter key now our installation process is start it's take one or five minutes depending on the speed of your pc so be a patient and wait for a few minutes now our installation completed if we just go to the reboot or run android x86 we got a one error and we solve this error by the simplest way just press click on ok and here we find one error ok console ok now we are going to stop this error by the simplest way or fix this error by the simplest way just close it and power of the machine just click on the power of the machine and click on the ok now just go to the our android once again we just go to the settings at first and just go to the storage and remove this android ios image okay so right click on this android ios image and remove attachment just go to the remove attachment and just go to the remove okay and then just press the okay press ok on click ok now we just launch our android os once again okay and we just find our error once time okay uh, we are putting our android os second time okay now just click on the android and here we find our error okay this is the our actual error okay detecting android x86 found at dev sta okay and console error so this problem is solved by the simplest way the way is first of all just type reboot and reboot our pc then as soon as our booting process is start just press e then i show how to fix this okay first of all just type reboot and just hit enter key on your keyboard after that rebooting process is started okay and then press e key when the rebooting process is start press e key now just press e key just press e key at the booting position now once again press e key and here here we just type n o m o d e s e t first time space space is the important get space 
then just type n o m o d e s e t just type n o m o d e s e t just type n o m o d e s e t hit enter key on our keyboard and as soon as our process is start we see what we'll do okay now just press p key now just press p key and now our android os is starting okay here we find our android os is started now we set up our android os okay here i just click on the start english united state and just click on the start here we find wi-fi i just go to the see all wi-fi network and just go to the virtual wi-fi now it's go to the update okay i want, don't want to coffee or just go to the next don't coffee now add your email id and then password just click on the next and then password okay just add your password now and then just click on the next agree agree the terms and condition just click on the next add your current country and then just go to the next it is for the time date and time more 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 accept it okay we do not want any pattern or any tablet lock okay so just go to the not and just go to the skip anyway no thanks just scroll down and just go to the skip scroll down and just go to the skip no thanks i give it the quick step and just one and here is the our android os running on the our windows 10 or any other windows operating system windows 10 windows 7 8 8.1 or any other windows operating system so guys this is the simplest way to download install and run android ios image any android ios image on our windows 10 or any other windows operating system by the simplest way so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel Thank you guys.